What's good guys, this is Morazzo Unique today, man, in this best video, man, I'm gonna be showing y'all boys, as y'all can see from the thumbnail and the title, bro, I'm gonna be showing y'all boys how to dribble in NBA 2K21 and the best dribble moves in NBA 2K21, man. So yeah, as y'all boys seen in um, my jump shot videos and stuff like that, and all my gameplay videos, I am a good dribbler, you know what I'm saying? I know how to dribble, I know what moves are good, what moves are effective for NBA 2K21, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna show you guys all the best ways to get open in NBA 2K21 current gen as of right now, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know what I'm saying? As of, you know, when you're watching this video. So yeah, if y'all boys enjoyed this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel, bro. But um, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into this banger, man. Let's go! So basically, these are my drill moves right here. Um, if y'all just want to copy them down, these are the best drill moves as of NBA 2K21 now, bro. So yeah, if y'all boys enjoyed this video, make sure y'all boys smash that like button. But um, yeah. So basically, these are my drill moves. These are the best drill moves. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you guys put on all these drill moves. Um, you know what I'm saying? Or you're not gonna be able to do any drill moves that I show you properly. So yeah, without further ado, let's just get right into this dribble tutorial, man. All right, guys. So the first thing that I recommend doing when you guys go to your my court. Is just go to your phone, you know what I'm saying, and call a teammate to your mic court. All right, so once you scroll all the way down past your friends, you're gonna see a bunch of your teammates that you're on the team with. I'm just gonna invite Kyle Lowry as an example, and then once he joins, um, you guys should basically just be able to just do it right after. Just press X, go all the way down to where it says um, personal workout, and just put yourself on offense and put the NBA player that you invited on defense. Now, what this is gonna do, this is gonna basically make it so. Um, you can literally dribble from, you know what I'm saying, full court all the way up to the other half of the court without having to, like, you know, without having to turn around and stuff like that. So, I'm just, this is probably going to be the easiest way that I'm going to show you guys dribble moves. So, the first dribble move that I'm going to show you guys is this move right here. Um, this is what you call the speed glitch. So, yeah, um, it works pretty effective. So, yeah. So, basically, what you guys are going to want to do is if the ball's in your left hand, you're just going to want to flick to the right side diagonally up without holding turbo. And as soon as you do that, you're just going to want to move up with the left stick just a little bit and then just hold turbo. And then it'll just make you, you know what I'm saying, speed boost. Just like that, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. So basically, the um, next move that I'm going to show you guys with this is um, this move right here. So it's just another way to like combo up. You know what I'm saying? So what you guys are going to want to do, all right, is basically you're going to want to flick. If the ball's in your right hand, you're going to want to flick diagonally up to the left. And then you're going to want to move to the right as soon as you flick it up. All right, so flick it up and then move to the right. And then it's just going to do that little um, speed boost. And then you guys could also combo this up. So you can do that move, that move, and then, you know what I'm saying, curry slide, and then go back that way. And it also kills the defenders like crazy. So yeah, that's literally the speed glitch, all right? I'm gonna show you guys one more speed glitch and it looks like this. It's literally just a step back, um, just like that. So all you guys are gonna want to do is basically just, if the, if the ball's in your um, left hand, you're gonna wanna sprint to the left side, flick diagonally down to the right, or to the left, sorry about that. And then as soon as you do it, so as soon as I do it to the left, I'm just gonna wait and then run like move the left stick to the left side a little bit and then just hold sprint while I'm moving just like this So I'm gonna show you guys real quick. So these are the moves that I do coming up the court You know what I'm saying? Um, It's really easy to understand Like bro, I'm gonna be honest with you. These moves are actually really helpful And the next move that I'm gonna show you guys is the curry slide so a lot of people know what this is already. Um, if you guys don't though, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. So basically, what you guys are gonna want to do is if the ball's in your left hand, you're just gonna wanna um, flick diagonally down to the left, or to, to the right, sorry about that. And when you do it, you're just gonna wanna hold it a little bit longer than actually flicking it. Cause when you flick it, it's gonna look like that. So you have to hold it basically. But not for too long, cause then it's just gonna like stop you. So just basically do that. 
And then the moves that I like to do is I like to combo up with, with the speed glitch. And I do this a lot because it just works a lot. So you can literally act like you're about the speed boost. Like I'll show you guys real quick. I'll show you guys. So say I'm coming up the court. You know, I got to get my pass my defender. I can act like I'm speed boosting to the right. But then I actually curry slide and combo up in green right in their eyes. You feel me? Like you could do a lot with this. Like, you could literally bait them in thinking you're, you're actually gonna um, speed boost to the side, but you're really not. Like this, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's that easy, bro. And then, the next move that I'm gonna show you guys is one of the most overused moves in NBA 2K21, but it really, really helps. Um, and it's gonna be the momentum. Um, and what I mean by overuse is, is just a lot of people use it because it's very effective, alright? So... The ball's in your left hand, right? What you guys are going to want to do is flick the right stick up and then flick the left stick to the right side. So just like this. So it should look like this. And this is what you... I don't necessarily use this unless I'm doing like this move right here. Unless I'm doing that move because it doesn't really work that much unless you like spam it or do it behind the back with it. Like that. You know what I'm saying? And just do a speed boost. You know what I'm saying? Go crazy, green up. You know what I'm saying? But look. So, I like to basically use this move when I'm coming up the court as well. I like to spam momentum. You know what I'm saying? But, um, basically how you do that, you're just going to basically do vice versa. So, if the ball's in my right hand, I'm just going to flick up on the right stick and flick the left stick to the um, left side. And then, you're just going to want to spam that. So, yeah. It's pretty simple. Just, if you, if, you momentum, if you momentum to the right, the way to practice this to get it down is momentum to the right. And then just momentum to the left right after. Like, literally, just do this. And then eventually, you'll be able to do, like, something like this. You know what I'm saying? And, um, yeah. So, the next move that I'm going to be showing you guys is the crossover 16 cheese. So, it looks like this. Um, it's not really that. It's kind of effective. Sometimes I do this. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes behind screens it works good, but I don't really use it in game a lot unless you know what I'm saying I just need a big um, Separation from my opponent and he's gonna fall into the screen Then I use that move So basically how you guys do this move is if the ball's in your right hand You're just gonna want to hold R2 and basically hold it to um, the left So just normally flick it across to the left sometimes you get that through the legs animation and um what I like to do with this move is I like to just combo up, go crazy, you know what I'm saying? I just like to do good with this move, bro. Like, this move is actually pretty good. If you can combo up with it, you're going to be goaded, bro. The next move that I'm going to show you guys is the quick stop, all right? Now, I posted a tutorial on that, um, like, a month ago, and it did pretty good. Um, and that's the quick stop if you guys didn't know yet. So, basically, how you guys do the quick stop is, all right, so if you're, if you're running to the um, left right with the ball um see how the player is just like flicking the ball between his legs like that so just like this like that's what you want all right you don't want this you don't want that you don't want this all right you don't want just a behind the back you don't want to do that sometimes it does this you know what i'm saying but you really want this all right you really want this all right so it should look like this um so yeah, I'm going to show you guys comboing up real quick. Me just comboing up, going crazy, and I'm going to show you guys a quick stop. So that's the quick stop right there, alright? So you guys can combo these moves together as you please, um, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's the quick stop. That's the combos that I always use. Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's not going to be like perfect each time you do it. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you're gonna get that animation, and honestly, bro, I feel like the quick stop is so overpowered, bro. Like, no lie. And the speed glitch. A lot of people hate the speed glitch because it's very, like, very, very helpful. Um, and a lot of people say it takes no skill and stuff like that, but it's literally speed boosting from 2K16, bro. It's it's speed boosting. That's all it is, bro. Honestly. That's what speed glitch is, bro. It's just called speed speed glitches here. It's literally speed boosting. Like, you'll see. 
like you'll see this little speed boost watch you'll see i'll show you see that little speed boost i just got bro just off of that step back like it's crazy you know what i'm saying that's why it's so overpowered because it is probably like the best move to get open um a lot of people wouldn't be good without it but me personally i don't need speed glitching bro i really don't but why not use it if it's in the game you feel me so yeah that's how you guys dribble um in nba 2k21 make sure you guys put my dribble moves on um i appreciate the recent support lately it means a lot to me let me know any other videos you guys want to see on the channel um thank you guys so much for 6k subscribers you know what i'm saying but um yeah i'll see y'all boys in the next video man peace